first let me introduce myself. I'm Molly Pettit. I'm a broadcast journalist in motorsport. I've been racing myself for many years and I just love the feeling of pure happiness that I get from driving a car. Guys, what a day. One of you comes to the stage end here at the power stage as world champion for the fifth time. The other one as rally winner for the first time. Seb, how do you describe this? World champions because you never gave up. World champions because the fight for the win meant taking the extra risk. Absolutely unbelievable you taking your first podium and it's here in Finland. I can't believe it. It's the most amazing day of my life. Welcome back to us here in the studio and I am joined by the driver who finds himself at the very top of the intermediate standing, Simon Olofsson. Can you uh, tell uh, me what to expect? Uh, no. No? I can't really. It's a, it's a fast stage, that's all I can say. A few small, small jumps, water crossing and some high speed corners. You'll enjoy it. What is the update on the underwear story? I haven't got it back. I have my underwear. <laughs> oh, I don't know if you can put this day into words, but please, let's hear from you. I have nothing to say. Nothing. It is a second flagship car from relatively new car manufacturer Xpeng, founded in 2014. Three Seb, different what a decades. strong finish this rally, a power stage victory, your 50th WRC victory, your eighth Rally Monte Carlo victory, but it is your last season as a full-time driver. How emotional is this win? It's about eight degrees below freezing and the conditions are incredible. Beautiful sunrise this morning. Thierry, the next couple of minutes are probably going to be the most exciting ones of your career. Is it good to see old friends tonight? <laughs> For sure, I have uh, a few of them that uh, I had some great battle. Uh... Second place in Rally Poland. It's worth nothing, like nothing. <sighs> it must feel good and you're smiling and you're, you're starting 2020 like you finished 2019. How good does it really feel to be in front of Nicholas with that new car as well? Torstein Eriksson's first <laughs> podium. Oh, I cannot believe that. It's uh, wow. That means a lot to me. He's got Andreas, to talk to Molly. that was a fair, outright, head-to-head -head battle with four-time world champion Sebastian Ogier, and you did it. You won this rally. WRC have taken all four manufacturer cars on tour here to Milan, Italy, Piazza Duomo to show them off for the very last time. Two brilliant days here in Rally Poland. You must be pleased with that. No. You know, the amount of work we put in, you know, in all this, you know, and in the end you get nothing. It's too hard. It's too hard.